there. This video is going to live. Very extreme mayhem, Christmas snow watch weather forecast. UK, 2022 likes this video. Please music, it. Please have a thumbs up. Tighten the amount. This is on this morning. It's 10 21 a.m. in the morning and it's the 21st of December. 2022, guys. It's talking about snow, guys, here across the south and southern England on Boxing Day evening at 1800 time wise. It's up there, p.m. So it's potentially possible we could get a white Christmas across southern England on Boxing Day. Just like the year of 1927. Which was unpredicted, guys. It wasn't predicted by the Met Office back then, night 27. It came out of nowhere. It was an unexpected snowfall event. Well, this is what could happen this winter of 2022 across the South East and Southern England, South and Southern England regions. We could have a white Christmas in the South East Southern England on Boxing Day. Maybe not white Christmas on Boxing, well, Christmas Day, but a white Christmas on Boxing Day. But I could be wrong. But this is a close run. This forecast is to change. Don't make this the last one, guys. I am so convinced. There's a lot of energy atmosphere at the moment. Cape is lifting. The energy is literally. Flying all over the place, so there's anything that could go on and kick to sink the next week or so across uh, the South East Southern England. Don't rule out snow, guys, across the day because the South East Southern England is. And this is the forecast from American um, after the 6 cent uh, GFA model, model American model, it's about 12 cent uh, GF model today. Talking about it being a mild Christmas with a south westerly wind and it'd be a high of 11 Celsius and cloudy across the South East Southern England region. And across the north of the UK, it's about the, the Grand Prince of Scotland and Highland Scotland of a chance of 25% chance of a little bit of wintry showers. Maybe that's because the um, uh, Shetland Island is about lower weight, so a chance to higher for the North York at White Christmas on Christmas Day. And this is the upper air temperature, of course, way from Tan local today. And the red line is a 30 average line. The white line's where the temperature going is staying above it. It does go down slightly below as you run towards the new year, uh, across uh, Wake Town locally. And it's sunshine quite a bit. And then the green right off that's the green line, that's um, the operation of that sunshine quite a lot. That's not going down to the new like it was supposed to be, well, it was recently, so it's definitely looking like a mild start to the year of 2023, of course, uh, working town locally, because South is now, but this forecast is to change. And this is the forecast of working town today. It won't be light showers this morning, that's wrong. There's no light showers this morning because working town locally, so it should be a dry day today, mostly. And Thursday, talking about it being, uh, well, clay and cloudy in the morning, showers in the afternoon. Friday is like a really wet one in the morning. Of course, working town locally, and it's going to be cloudy and a high of 12 Celsius or 11 Celsius on uh, Christmas Eve. Let's say I fly up to Austria on my ski holiday. Wish me luck. Got to get fast border control. I don't think it'll be a problem. And uh, 25th of December, uh, it should be quite um, well, quite cloudy and high levels. It's quite mild. I think it might snow on Christmas Eve, uh, well, Christmas Day into the evening. It's Boxing Day. I could be wrong. It's all about it being uh, light rain on uh, Boxing Day, but they call it Stevens Day because working town locally. But I think it might snow on Christmas. Day or box day this weekend, I wouldn't be surprised because working town locally. You can see the temperature's down to about average then, like eight to nine Celsius, about average temperature because working town into the new year, especially. Um, but you know, I just wouldn't rule out without green and blocking over Greenland, anything could happen in the next week or so across the UK, for South East, and suddenly the region weather. And this is the forecast in American uh, Joel State. It's talking about a storm, storm, storm Anthony with ring 84 miles per hour across the RSC and 50 miles per hour across the southwest. Uh, counties of Dorset and Cornwall into Somerset and 40 miles per hour and south in southern English. But this is just, you know, one of many outcomes, many power lines we could be down. This is forecast of Christmas Day because we're in town. 0% cloudy, a high of 11 Celsius, there's no chance to have a white Christmas moment. I wouldn't be really surprised if there is a white Christmas. In Fort William, 25% chance of white, white Christmas, high of 11 Celsius, showers. And uh, in Aberdeen, well, 25% chance and a high of about uh, 5 Celsius and sunny. In Aberdeen, Scotland, and this is in uh, Wick in Sheffield Island. It's about light rain, a high of seven Celsius. These are the ball that's to do. Let me show this here. And you want to see it in SSW, you want to see these colours here, yellow and red, penetrating the North Pole, splitting the ball that's that's do at its roots. So, yeah, we have got a chance we get to the 5th, 4th to 5th of January across um, the show this here with 10 HP of uh, an SSW, guys, happening. And this is at 10 HPA. And this is what's going on. It is below the grey line. The grey line is the average one. What we see in SSW to happen, what is this black line going straight up here? To get SSW. So, guys, it looks like it might be a white Christmas stuff in Southern England. I wouldn't rule it out. This is my last Christmas ever forecast. Have a happy new year and a happy Christmas from me and my friends Jack, Jim Burr and Sparky from the ITF Friday Feeding radio station show and my friend John Andrews from the Waking Radio Station show. I love the show. Hope you liked the video. Please a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel, Sign Gels, and the force be with you always. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone.